Hey guys, so today we're going to talk about some exercises uh, and warm-ups that you can do right here at home. And we're going to start with some open strings. Feel free to have your hand here at the neck or at the upper bout. And start with G string, long four quarter notes. Try to use all of your bow and then move on to the other strings. Also practice in a mirror and try to keep your bow as straight as possible. And E. Then you're going to do the exact same thing, open strings, but this time with eight uh, sixteenth notes off the string. Practice getting that really consistent and stay low at the frog. Next thing you're going to do is play double stop. So you're going to play A and D string at the same time and you're going to do this rhythm right here. So feel free to do that a couple times. The point is to open, open up the sound of your instrument and really keep a smooth and connected bow. I'm gonna do that one more time for you guys. Okay, so that's it for our warm ups, and now let's move on to scales. We're gonna start with G major, um, just very slowly, all separate bows. focus on intonation, practice with the tuner please, and um, really go slowly and try to keep everything as still as possible. Once you figure that out, then you want to slur two in a row, two in a bow, and also four in a bow. So I'm going to do two for you right now. So that's G major. Um, two things with these scales, you want to speed up a little bit each time so you work different tempos. And also on the way up the scale, you want to use open strings like we talked about. On the way down, try to use your fourth finger so that you get those worked in as well. And um, now for the final thing is for advanced strings and philharmonic, um, we're going to do another scale this time, it's D major. So you're going to do separate, slur two and a bow, four and a bow, um, but all in third position. So find your D, second finger in third position on the G string, and I'm going to play the separate D major scale.
that's separate, and now here's two in a bow. <laughs> Also notice how I'm trying to divide my bow as evenly as possible. So if you're playing two, just try to divide your bow in half. If you're playing four, and you're going to divide in quarters. So here's the last one. There you go. Stay safe, everybody, and happy practicing.